Rivalry going on. Here Game go. one. I wonder. Okay. How many times have you seen Mr. Konkon actually do the zero death? Too many. <laughs> is that an amount? Is that, is that a respectable amount? Yeah. Uh, it is. It is. Yeah. Luigi actually one of the characters that got hit with the patch change. It's pretty hard. Uh, lots of interesting good things going for him with like smash attacks, but just stopping the, the semi wobbly he has the going. Semi wobbly. On. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh no, no double jump. Too deep actually. prodigy. Yeah. That's, what, well, that's why he's a prodigy and not the master, man. It's still learning. Oh, okay. I mean, hey, during the end of Smash 4, he was working. He was the he monster. Was working. Didn't he win the final tournament? Yeah, he did. So. Okay. North Cal champion himself, Mr. Kon Kon. A lot of respect for Mr. Kon Kon right now, actually. Just understanding that he's at an advantage, he doesn't have to do anything. This is kind of how Kon Kon plays, though. It's like once he takes the lead, he turns into a turret. He stays stationary uh -huh. unless you come to him while he lays on the ledge. Okay, some more ledge trapping. Wow, his ledge trapping is insane. Oh, oh man. What a reaction. Yep. Okay, Prodigy actually finally was able to find some footing, but... Didn't respect him there. Slap chop coming through, man. Now, Mr. Kong Kong is just kind of running he over him. At this really point. just ran up and just upbeat. There we go. That's the kind of hits that you need if you're Prodigy to get back into this match. But you need this edge guard, too. But giving up the stage, not oh. able to find the kill yet. Yeah, Mr. Kong Kong. That's the thing about Luigi. He can throw out these, like, wall of aerials, and you just have to, like, be able to find your footing, find your way in. And it's hard. Special. Ooh. With this lead that Mr. Kong Kong has going, he does not need to approach Prodigy at all. Ooh, what a great air dodge. Wow, the parries are so on point for Mr. Kong Kong as well. Yo, you know that dash attack kills? In this game? Yes. I did not. It's it's actually terrifying. Not so much uh, sissy punches anymore. No, man. yeah, that last one hurts. Ooh, nice. Down air. Ta-da. <laughs> Off the top. Yeah, find his first kill. People just sleep on that down there. There's so much kill power. Yeah, I think they're just adjusting to it because before you could be able to, you were able to fall out of it, right? Now, stuck in it the whole time. How are you gonna get off this ledge? Regain your footing, Mr. Kong Kong. Ah, Take it over the no skies. Respect. It's a twister. <laughs> Mr. Kong Kong throwing out a barrage of aerials, managed to find something, and actually caught uh, Prodigy slipping. Right up there. Pretty unfortunate first stock for Prodigy. I think that's the, the mentality that you have to have going into game two. You kind of slipped up and you were playing from behind. Mm -hmm. So now, Kong Kong in the driver's seat with this game one. Prodigy, how are you going to fight back? Yeah. Pretty much only has Mario in this game. Yeah, before. yeah. I mean, it's game still, what, like a month old? Mm -hmm. Two months? Two months now? I see uh, a lot of people are opting to go with multiple characters. In this yeah, game. that's true. I think that's going to be the way it goes as this metagame develops, but for right, right now. It's the color switch this yep. time, though. This man's ready for a wedding. All right, and going to Yoshi's story. Yeah, just shrinking up the size of the stage a little bit. Maybe he wants to play a little bit closer to Kong Kong. So that way, if Kong Kong does take the lead, he doesn't have to chase him down and go into any uh, tricky areas. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I do want to see uh, Prodigy kind of go for more whiff punishes. You see Kong Kong throwing out a lot of moves. Oh, no, 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 no. Off no, the no, top? No. That's We're going to do it, baby. That's why he picked this stage. <laughs> Prodigy sending him to the heavens. Yeah. And Prodigy actually just super comfortable staying on the top platform, too. Like, he wants to be there. Now, Kong Kong is going to be the one having to fight back. Luigi, definitely a character who has a little more difficulty approaching others. He really wants to have that lead. Okay, nice movement right there from Mr. Kong Kong, but still gets caught slipping. Wow, Prodigy has really turned around game two. Oh, he really has now. This combo is still running. Oh my goodness. Had that been a fourth smash though? I think you might have even wanted to go for a forward air right there and try to dunk him off the side. Yeah, nice. Great oh. way to get out. Mr. Kong Kong actually scrambling These right there. These perfect shields are so on point for Mr. Kong Kong. Nice. As you get up. Oh, no. Not able to. All right. Double jump. Up B. Okay. Nice. Not dying from so Mr. Kong Kong going deep. Ah, yeah, Prodigy wow. allows him back. Oh, my goodness. That scoop on the tornado. Wait, no back throw? Oh, this is difficult. Both these guys just looking for a kill any way they can get it. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. This is a really, really a flip from game. Oh, my God. Now the Don't flood coming into play.
This is huge. It's critical. Oh, okay. Ah, that was it. That was definitely something there. Wow, Mr. Konkon still living at 160 right now. Ooh, great uh, ledge get up right there. Prodigy, air dodges. Nice. Oh, back throw? No. Oh, Pizza oh. throw. Not going <laughs> to do it. Ah, uh, okay, that's it. Yeah. Yeah, you know that move has invincibility on startup? This is insane. <laughs> F-tilt? Does he have a jump? I don't think he has oh, a jump. Oh, that flood is... <gasps> Perfect timing for a misfire if you're Mr. Kong Kong right there, but still leading to his death. Down tilt up air can do it. That timing was amazing. Yeah. For that down tilt? I mean, Prodigy definitely turned this thing around right now. Mm -hmm. Firmly in the driver's seat. Look at these combos coming through. Are we going to get another one oh, off the top? Okay. No. We're safe. Mr. Kong Kong is safe. 88% though. Mr. Kong Kong definitely sweating after that last combo though. Mm -hmm. Not looking very healthy. And he doesn't have an air dodge. Okay, let's get something started. Double fair, triple fair, no double jump. Nice spike. That's how you fight your way back in this match, Mr. Kong Kong. Still at 110%, but he has a few more breaths of life left uh, in him this game. Ah, uh, okay. I like that. He actually didn't go for the roll for the longest time, and now he did, but... Uh, yep, the dash back, reverse of Smash, going to do it for Prodigy. Yeah, we kind of saw uh, Kong Kong get up and try to do, like, a jab. Mm -hmm. Got caught. That up Smash. Yeah, that's just cleanly beat it, actually. Now, Prodigy just looking extra clean. I know. Game. Was it the stage? I think so. That uh, definitely helped. Those platforms were uh, what allowed him to take him to the top and kill him so early in that mm -hmm. first stock. Right. Yeah, that first stock was, oh, God. Yeah. I think uh, Kong Kong might want to go to a more flat stage and not allow these Rufio combos. Maybe Kalos? Maybe keep it close with some Castle Siege if you can. I Castle didn't see Siege? what yeah. the stage was. Yo, Lila. Here we go. It's going to be Town and City. And City. Yeah, smart. You actually can't die off the top as easily because the last zone is uh, higher on the top. But, I mean, you still got platforms. Still exist. These guys content to just trade little hits in neutral. Trying to get something started. Now Prodigy finally getting a combo started. <laughs> These platforms are the perfect formation to keep the combo extended. Yeah. Prodigy actually just doing a lot of sharking right now. Keeping Kong Kong in there with these up airs. And understanding the timing for uh, Kong Kong's nares. Ooh. Kong Kong barely avoiding that forward smash right there. Ooh, okay. We got some nice dash dancing. And Kong Kong manages to zone break that. Now your Prodigy, you don't want to be too confident right now. We know Luigi has so much explosive power. You do not want to be grabbed by this man. Oh, great whiff punish yeah. on the jab. Up smash coming through for Prodigy. This is quite the turnaround from game one. I, I have not seen such confident, such a confident up smash on that whip, on the whip punish on a jab. Full confidence, man. He's just getting in there. He hasn't been grabbed this set, I don't believe, except for uh, one time during that Yoshi story game. Yeah. Okay. Just content with staying on the platform right here. This is great play, oh. man. You don't have to engage Luigi. You have the lead right now. Yeah, what's interesting... Ooh. Oh, okay. Judo chop. Nice. Yeah, what's interesting was uh, Prodigy actually abusing the fact that his uh, air speed is incredibly high. Mr. Kong Kong actually tried to chase uh, Prodigy down with a dash attack. Still not able to keep up. And look at these empty hops. Even when he lands in front of Kong Kong, he's doing a defensive option so he does not get grabbed. You do not want to be sucked by the uh, the Poltergust 3000 right there. I like it. That roll back at the ledge, you'd expect someone to grab, right? It's a, it's the common practice of roll at the ledge and grab the back throw, but Prodigy actually went, actually went for a back air right there. Prodigy Ooh. trying to take him off the top again. Yo, Kong Kong, actually now pressuring Prodigy. Ooh. Ah, oh, that landing down air. Despite Kong Kong having so much percent racked up on him, it's too comfortable. Mm, these back airs are really pulling through for Prodigy right now. Oh. Poking through that shield is that down air. Nice scoop up with the down tilt. And that's going to do it. Back air. Yeah, back air. Really working out for Prodigy right here. Just out spacing a lot of uh, Kong Kong's aerials or even just out, uh, out prioritizing them. And Prodigy is just playing the matchup itself perfectly right now. Not oh. giving Kong Kong any breathing space. Another grab combo starting up. He remixes it, gets him to the ledge, not able to get the dunk he was Yeah, and you know Kong Kong's panicking too from that uh, from that up air. He did an air dodge. Normally you'd see him there, right? Ooh. There we go. The punch is coming through. 
think you said that dash attack actually is what ooh, Prodigy just missing the ledge right so there. So low. That actually happened game one too. So ooh. nice. What a great fair to get out of that down air. Oh, Kong has got him cornered. Mm -hmm. This is actually very scary for Prodigy right now. Even though he has a percent lead, this pressure is insane. How are you going to fight your way back to center stage? He does, but it took 67% for him to do mm -hmm. so. Now Kong Kong holding him back at the corner again, voluntarily by Prodigy. Yeah, Prodigy actually really using the platforms pretty well. This is Kong Kong's counter pick too. Hong Kong with the stage control. Prodigy able to reset neutral. Has him held down at this corner right now. Yeah. Prodigy tried to go for a jump read right there, but you can't expect a Luigi player to blow their jump that early. Mr. Kong Kong missing the grab, allowing Prodigy to sneak in underneath. Kong Kong having to recover deep. Ooh, forward smash. Oh no, back throw? Is that really it? 100 at the ledge, not able to do it. Oh, what a great down air. Okay. This is a tight set, Jason. It's down to the wire. Prodigy's got him off stage. Oh my the goodness. Flood. The flood. So much mileage off this flood. Kong Kong forced to go oh, deep in Prodigy. Prodigy. Just so deep every time off stage.